Howdy folks! Welcome back to our channel. Thank you for watching the video. Really do appreciate it. So I'm in the process of uh, giving back to our community in my tin here. I have something that I'm burying for somebody else to find. That's right. Treasure hunters, metal detectors, we're generally giving people we like to share. Um, that's the video. Obviously we like to share our adventures. So in this can I have a very special treat. It's an 1861 coin from Italy. It's a Via. Here, let me pull it out. I'll show you. You guys probably want to see it. So uh, over the years, I've been doing this for a very long time, and I've gained a lot from this. This is a five centesimi, 1861. Five centesimi. 1861 it's an Italian coin that I dug up guess where that's right in Italy so I'm gonna date my note so that whoever finds this knows when it was buried so my note says greetings treasure hunter congrats on discovering this tin the treasure within is an Italian gem the coin is dated 1861 it was dug up from the soils of northern Italy you may add to the tin, swap a treasure, or keep it all for yourself. The choice is yours. Happy hunting. Treasure in the box. had some water to pour over the top of it to try to get it to look a little less obvious but there we go here I'm gonna add this to throw them off the scent Doot. nah that's not nice I'm not gonna do that I'll pick this up and take it out with me okay all right, enjoy the show. just gave me back first find of the day don't know if it's valuable but it's pretty check out that check out how this shines Look at that. pretty cool pretty good for a first find I think it's gonna be a good day okay so I've got a solid 52 I'm not sure what a 52 is Figured I'd five dig this just to see. Hey. Okay. Well, now we know 52 is a Mexican coin. Let's see. It says United States of Mexico. Uh, it's a 50 cent piece, 2002. There we go. Not bad. I was hoping for silver, but I'll take it. Mexican coin. It's gonna be trash. There it is. There it is. This came across as 93 on my detector. Clearly. It is not treasure, it is trash. Rusted bottle cap. On to the next find. Don't know if it's a good ring. It is a ring. I just dug it up. It came up as a 43 on my detector. 
There it is. Uh, oh, man. Well, I guess I should have looked at it before I got excited, huh? Dang it. Junk jewelry. Next time, you never know what you're gonna find. Got a nice little find here. This one's legit. It's real. I don't know if you guys can see it. Let me see if I can. Can you see my hand? Going down. Nope, a little too far back. There we go. Looks like silver, maybe. Nice little owl charm. That's definitely a keeper. I'll clean it up and I'll look for the maker's mark. When I get home, it looks like it might even have a hint of gold on there, too. That's a good find. Yeah. Well, it's about that time. I've been hunting for about three hours, maybe longer, probably longer. Um, my wife's probably about to call me for dinner, so uh, I should probably find a good stopping point. And this is that stopping point. So, all right, so let's see if I can angle this so that you guys can see the good stuff. There we go. Sweet, look at that shine. Bling, bling, bling. Bling, bling, check that out. So I've got this earring, pretty good find. It looks like it may have been gold plated. It's pretty sturdy. Um, I think it's glass, pretty sure it's glass, but it shines really nice, doesn't it? Okay, this one is the real deal. This is definitely a legit charm. Where are you guys at? The owl, I'm gonna clean that up and I'll share that with you as part of this video and then man this was the heart stopper today this little ring about gave me a heart attack i thought i had found a wedding band and lo and behold it's just junk jewelry still cool to find and a very nice beautiful day thanks for watching and uh, we'll see you next time bye